Welcome to another Getting Started with Concrete 5 video. Uh, if you haven't already, you should check out the Intro to Concrete 5 video, It'll give you a little bit of context as to what it is and how it works. Uh, in this video, we're going to take a little time to talk about how you add pages and update navigations with a Concrete 5 site. The first thing that you should know is that every page in your site fits somewhere into a master tree. Uh, hierarchy, whatever you want to call it, your whole site is one big tree starting with home. Um, you can go to the sitemap, which I got to by clicking on dashboard, and you can see how your site's arranged. Uh, you can see I can expand and collapse, and um, these are all actually represent pages in our site. Now, a key thing to remember is with Concrete 5, a page is just a page, it's just a page. There's no categories or collections or folders or topics or sections or anything like that. Um, all I did to get these pages underneath About Us was make a page from About Us. Uh, so let's just do that real quickly. We'll go to the About Us page. And if we wanted to add another page here, I'd simply hit Edit and Add Subpage. Uh, you get to choose between all of the page types available. On this demo site, there's only one. And then you get this little interface that lets you enter some information about the page. The name is what's going to show up in navigations and um, uh, in the main title bar of your, of your website right up here. Um, so let's add a page about our board. Uh, you can see as I type, the alias field is auto-typing along with me, except it put a little dash where the space was. Um, what this is going to do is make the URL field uh, have a, a pretty URL or a vanity URL uh, that matches uh, this string here, uh, which is really good for search engine optimization. The public date and time is not when the page will launch or anything like that, but you can do that uh, in another way. Uh, all this is is when this page was made, and we use it when we need to order a navigation by chronology or uh, some other tidbits. So not tremendously important. You can probably uh, just glaze over this, and you can always change any of this later. Uh, the short description is used throughout Concrete 5 for different things. Our search engine will use it. Uh, different blocks will display it. Uh, and most templates will insert it as a meta description. Uh, so it's probably worth your while to put something there. Um, oops. So let's add this page. And you can see we're on a new blank page, uh, already in edit mode. I can roll over things. I could change these existing default blocks. Uh, or I could go ahead, add a content block to the main space. Blah, 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 blah. So once I go ahead and publish my edits, you'll see on this navigation over here, our board is bold. We're on the our board page. If I click on one of these other pages, you can see it's updated the navigation everywhere to include our board. Uh, and it's just that easy. If I take you back over to the full sitemap, you can see here's our board. Uh, it shows up in the About Us section because we were on the About page when we first made it. Uh, if I wanted to rearrange the order of that navigation, I could just drag and drop this page right here. And now when I visit that page, oops, that's the About page. Now when I visit one of these pages, you can see it's right here in the middle. Uh, and it will be updated everywhere. Um, and I can even rearrange my site. Uh, that way. So if I go back to the sitemap and I say, you know what, our board is so important, I want it right underneath the home page. I could copy, I could alias it, which is just going to create a, a reference to it, but will redirect me over to where it lives under about. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and move it. And now you can see it shows up in our site uh, right there. And if I visit the about page again, you can see it showing up in this main nav now. So all these navigations are being programmatically generated. Uh, they know where to look in the tree and, and how many children or siblings to display. And uh, it's just that easy to update your website. <laughs>